Mr. Gone, I'm back with the Kiwi crowd destruction tutorial. I know it's uh, been a while since I said I told you I was going to do this. Sorry about the delay. There was a whole bunch of things. I'm not going to get into the details. But we are, in fact, going to do it today. So be prepared for some awesome stuff. If you're not familiar with the video, this is a... Uh, what it was it might be choppy it's sitting on my uh, my two terabyte drive not directly connected to this computer I'll drag it a little bit see the premise is I take these two videos the Kiwi crowd whatever tutorial or video that was and the um, the sky attack you know bombs and I combine them into one video it's pretty neat. I mean, you get the breathe, the smoke, the explosion. You get the characters, a whole bunch of particle work. Uh, it, it was a good time building that. Okay, combined into one particle fulfilled or filled tutorial. Kiwi crowd destruction. And this is what we'll be looking at making today. I'm going to show you uh, all the steps that I took into making this. Uh, character design I'm gonna go through kinda quick you know just because it's a simplistic character but I'm gonna show you how we set up the reference panels in Studio Max um, creating the character in Studio Max um, all the particle flow work all the afterburn work you can see um, you know and that alone is a mouthful I might even show you some low-level sound, uh, not engineering, but I guess like sound design, and uh, a program called, uh, uh, I forget what it's called, but it, you know, it's just a low-level program, but it's good enough to do a whole bunch of editing. So um, I guess we will get started with the Kiwi Crowd Destruction uh, Tutorial. I hope you're as excited as me because this one is awesome. <laughs> 